Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to show you um, what will be the beginnings of a unicorn junk journal. So as we're in 2022 now, this is a old calendar from last year, 2021, which was uh, unicorns by um, Anne Stokes. Um, so what I've started to do is just cut some of this up. Um, so these are the uh, sort of 12 images that were on the back of the calendar. This was the front cover. And here are some of the inside images that are absolutely gorgeous. Um, so I wanted to try and reuse these. So uh, what I'm going to do is uh, start to use these as the basis for my unicorn um, junk journal. Uh, so this is a wonderful way of using old bits and pieces up. So if you find you've got some old calendars lying around that you're going to get rid of, see if you can reuse the images because they are a wonderful basis for junk journals. You can use them for the covers, you can use them for the inside page signatures. They're really, really useful and saves waste. Um, so I will keep you posted on this. I'll come back to the camera shortly so you can see um, how this is coming together. So I will see you um, shortly for the rest of this video. So to start on my uh, decoration for my unicorn junk journal, I found something that I want to upcycle. So this is like a uh, planner that I've had for ages. I've used some of the pages, I've not used all of them, but you know, just sort of your standard sort of to-do lists and notes and contacts. And I thought, well, seeing as a lot of the pages are unused and some of them have been, and it's not one that I have kind of completely used up and I don't actually want to get rid of it yet um, why don't I use this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start building this into my unicorn junk journal so I'm gonna sort of add um, some sort of inserts my page signatures um, that are going to be sort of themed on unicorns. I'll keep these blank pages blank um, so of course they can be part of the junk journal. I'll add in um, some pages, some pockets, some tags um, and I'll probably also do some artwork of mine in here as well that's linked to unicorns. Um, I'll cover the front and the back of this and uh, the inside as well. Um, so yeah, I thought this would be a wonderful op opportunity to upcycle and use up some of the things um, that I've got. So I really do re recommend that that's a brilliant thing to kind of use your old junk to, um, you know, upcycle so that they don't just get thrown away. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the base of my Unicorn Junk Journal. Hi guys, so this is where I am uh, so far. Uh, so what I started to do is cut out some of the um, images from the calendar and I've sort of started to uh, make this into the cover. I had a little bit here left over that I didn't want to cut off so I thought I'd kind of make that into what will uh, be the beginnings of like a pocket. And uh, in here are the um, images from the back of the calendar which sort of show you uh, each image of the month so I've cut these up and these I'm going to use to make tags to go inside the journal and then on each of these little tabs here I've just 
um, sort of started to cover um, with some more I images. These are just um, sort of uh, strips of cutoffs. And then uh, here I've just got another couple of images. Uh, so just a way of using up some of the uh, different images from the uh, calendar and I've covered the back and the inside I'm about to do. Um, also, as you can see, I've got like this kind of fabric lace trim which had some double-sided tape on it. Um, so I've stuck this down just to sort of hide up some of the uh, messy edges just to make it look a little bit nicer and it happened to be the right colour which I think is uh, really quite good. It's this lovely sort of teal blue colour. Um, so I've started to use that on uh, some of the edges here and there uh, just to neaten things up a little bit. So this is where I am at the moment. I will put in uh, some page signatures, make some tags and pockets and I might make something just to hide the uh, uh, sort of binding uh, spiral bound um, part of uh, this journal. So this is where I am so far. Hi guys, so I wanted to show you uh, whereabouts I am in my unicorn junk journal. So I've been doing a little bit more and, and what I've started to do is make some of the tags with the uh, smaller images that I showed you. So what I've done is uh, some of the off cuts from these larger um, calendar images so when I'm sort of trying to um, match uh, one up so that I can do uh, sort of like an insert here sort of I'll, I'll cut out the image from one of these larger calendar ones and then I'll have like an off cut so what I've done is I've sort of kept all the off cuts and then just stuck these smaller images um, on them and then I'm going to get my hole punch make a little hole and then da da you've got some tags um, so that's those um, so I've started to sort of put some of these on um, sort of here. I've made a little pocket and a tag already for this one. And I've done, uh, I'm going to do another one here for this one and for um, the, this is the back, um, the inside of uh, the back cover. So I'm going to make um, some sort of pockets and continue making my tags.